Either God here coming to you live and direct with another video and in this video I just felt the need to um, share some visuals that I had on um, you know what I think about the metaverse and stuff like that you know what I think about the world that we in right now so basically um, these are visuals and I decided to draw them out Cause a lot of y'all don't, um, a lot of, well, a lot of viewers may not, um, visualize as easy as others. So I'm gonna just go over it with y'all. So basically, um, the applications or the apps on our phones, devices or whatever is the metaverse. We're already in the metaverse. The metaverse is not coming. We're already in the metaverse and we've been in the metaverse since they came and conquered the planet and put up all those satellites, phone um uh, phone line phone towers and uh all that. We've been in the we've been in the metaverse. Um uh, the metaverse is just upgrading, you know, so yeah. And we let them get too far ahead of us with this technology with this artificial technology um instead of um it helping us or us using it to uh, help us they're using it to destroy us and you know um make our world like their world um in some other realm so they brought all their little technology to Earth, the natural planet. But anyway, okay. So Rumble, those who don't know about Rumble, I don't know too much about it. I just found out about it. Um, but a lot of people are going to Rumble because it's unfiltered and uncensored, I believe. And I'm like, bruh, y'all don't see what they're doing? It don't matter if we on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, or Rumble. We're still being watched. We're being watched on Rumble. We're being watched on the other platforms. These platforms represent the fences that they got us in. Whether it be physical fences or mental fences. Either way, we still participate in, in their matrix. Which is these applications, these apps, these programs, the internet. And these apps also represent virtual streets. Virtual streets. You see what I'm saying? These are streets. You can either go to YouTube Street or you can go to Rumble Street. Um, if you don't like what's going on on YouTube, you feel like you're being censored too much, you're going to go to Rumble, where it's not being censored, a.k.a. the suburbs. This could represent the suburbs. This could represent the hood, whether it be YouTube, Instagram, or Facebook, etc. You know, and the elites, the elites, they're like, they like, go here, sheep. Or the conscious people, they they guide you from one platform to another. You see what I'm saying? And then they'll welcome you. Now they can watch you over here on Rumble, since you're not participating in YouTube no more because you mad because of how they rules and regulations are, like they got in real life. You know the uh, you got to follow the uh, community guidelines and all that type of crap that they make up and we comply with. Um. So yeah, community guidelines and stuff like that. Um, that's why on YouTube they have community um the community section where you can post you know stuff where your um followers and subscribers and stuff like that can communicate with each other in the community community section. So like I said, we already in the metaverse. The metaverse is just upgrading as far as I'm concerned. Um, I like to say that it's being destroyed, but like I say. These gas stations still working. These phone lines are still up. The internet still up. My phone still up. So, you know, when you know, like I said before, when they lights go out, then ours will come on. But since they lights still up, ours is off, and that's why we rely on their technology and their way of life, um, which is actually death, because nothing that they do um, benefits us in any type of way. Is actually to destroy us, and if you think otherwise, then um, 
have a good reincarnation. Um, but yeah, hopefully y'all get what I have here. It's pretty straightforward, but I'll run over it again. These are visuals. No matter what platform you on, you still being watched. So my goal or what I would like is for us to um, break up out of these fences, get offline because us being online and participating in all the applications and programs and stuff like that is getting us nowhere. It's literally um, helping us build their metaverse. It's helping us, uh, it's, it's helping them strengthen their metaverse and um, the more we own it, the more we uploading our um, information and stuff like that, they using it against us. Everything that we upload into the internet is going straight to the algorithms and then, you know, it's going to that little bot system that they have in place and, you know, the more you upload to the bot, the bot gets stronger and stronger, you know. So, yeah, I think this is a good visual. So, um, yeah, they get you to go from, from here to here. Or they can, you know, they can do it that way. When Rumble start tripping, or that platform start tripping, they'll get you to go right back on to um, another street or another platform. You see what I'm saying? So, yeah. With that being said, hope y'all enjoyed this video and share the message. Either God signing out. Peace.